You know, here at Look North, we uh, spend most of our time making films about people and places in the North, the very things we've been showing you tonight and every night. Well, believe it or not, someone once made a film about us making films. And that was Sheila Graeber, probably the North's best-known filmmaker, who's from South Shields. Well, five years ago, she gave up her job as an art teacher to concentrate full-time on making animated films, which have now won international acclaim. The best of her work is on show all this month at the DLI Museum and Arts Centre at Akeley Heads in Durham City. And Alan Powell has been to see her. This is how Sheila Graeber saw a day in the life of Look North back in 1977. The high-pressure world of television brought out all her talent for witty observation and her abiding fascination for finding out how people and machines work. Most of her animated art is aimed at teaching which is where it all began 15 years ago with the purchase of an 8mm cine camera. Since then, Sheila Graeber's output as a completely self-taught animator has been astonishing, although her original techniques have changed hardly at all. In my films, as you know, there's quite a few cuts because I've got cuts. Uh, in my films are artists because I taught art. Um, in my films are ships because I live near the tide. I think you just bring in, bring in things that are around you anyway and weave them in, as it were, into, into the uh, film. So do you still work, basically, in the same fairly laborious way that you well, worked at the laborious, beginning? Well, it isn't laborious, really. No, it isn't laborious. It's very easy. I think this whole myth uh, Disney's not around, so I can see, I mean, I love Disney stuff, you know, but whenever anybody says uh, animation, they oh, 25 dollars a second, oh, you know, millions of cells, thousands of little dwarfs tracing, painting, filming. Well, fine, in certain circumstances, yes, but also it'll be very simple, it'll be something you do at home on your dining room table. I've completed some films in two hours, no, no tremendous uh, work at all, others perhaps take longer, but it's really a very simple process, move, click, move, click. The Sheila Graeber exhibition shows how life is breathed into the still picture. It also acknowledges her debt to the great artists of the past. Leonardo, Michelangelo, William Blake, Van Gogh. The mimicry of different styles is the theme of Art Horses, her latest animated film. You can feed everything into this whole business of movement. You can feed in images, you can feed in sound, you can feed in fantasy, if you like, you can feed in real life. It will, it will accommodate anything. And you can pull these things in, and as they mix up, they mix up in a way, sometimes quite unexpectedly, and feed back on you and give you another idea. So it's a lovely medium for thinking things up. The magic work of Sheila Graeber. And the exhibition of her work is on all this month at the DLI Museum and Arts Centre at Akeley Heads in Durham.